Now to an update on a story only on two from last night at 10. Thieves target a group of veterans. Those thieves not only stole their work equipment, but the veterans' very livelihoods. Okay, just as I thought immediately after that story aired, incredible outpouring of support from you guys. Channel 2's Bill Spencer joining us live with the update. And Bill, really good news here. Incredibly good news, and you can see it on the faces of Chad Milner and his son right here. Chad's a Marine, spent eight years in the Corps. He started a company called Lawn Vets a year and a half ago. They do about 85 lawns a week. But last week, a week ago tonight, all of their equipment was stolen, effectively putting them right out of business. Basically what these guys did is cut the chain in half, cut all the locks off that we had. This is surveillance video showing the moment a group of thieves drove off with thousands of dollars in lawn cutting equipment belonging to the lawn vets, a group of hardworking veterans, all who risked their lives for this country, who formed their own lawn cutting company. Former Marine Chad Milner owns the company. He says the thieves took absolutely everything. It's just a terrible situation because myself and the, all the veterans who work for me, that's how we, that's how we survive, that's how we live, that's how we take care of our family. But now help for the lawn vets is pouring in from compassionate Houstonians like Thomas Verdon. Well, it's, uh, it's veterans and we, we owe those guys and gals that have done so much for us. Tom is donating an almost brand new Bobcat zero turn riding mower and trailer worth more than $6,000. Tom is giving from the heart for these brave men who've already given so much. These young men and ladies have given their lives and it's been going on for a long time for us in the United States and uh, it was a way I can contribute and give back. Tiffany Esposito and her husband Enzo also heard about the lawn vets and what happened to them. They're donating $50 of their hard-earned money to help get these veterans back to work. And a GoFundMe account has already been set up to help the lawn vets go back to work. And Chad is joining me with his son Ian right now live. But real quick, Chad, what do you want to say to all the people that are trying to help you out? I just want to say myself and my crew are so humbled and grateful for all the support and everyone reaching out for us and all my veterans. Beautiful. Thank you for your service, sir. sir You're appreciate a it. Fantastic Thank guy. You. you can go on our website, clicktohuse.com. We do have that GoFundMe site set up. It's on the home page. You can help out right now. They do need more help. Uh, we still are working to get them everything they need. Reporting live, Bill Spencer, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Great town, lots of support, Bill. Semper Fi to them.